and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Olivia, but you probably already knew that because you clicked on my video, and also this is my dog, Boeing. <laughs> so it is basically the beginning of March now, and to me that just signifies spring and all things that spring encompasses, which my favorite thing is spring cleaning. And on the topic of spring cleaning, that also kind of intertwines with like decluttering as well for me. And I kind of wanted to walk you guys through the process of how I declutter my closet. And I basically just want to share what a minimalist closet looks like for me. I know that minimalist wardrobes look very different for lots of people, but I tend to try to keep things pretty small and not really have like any excess or duplicates of certain types of clothing. So I am going to declutter my closet and then I'm going to show you how I recycle and like dispose properly and responsibly of all of the things that I don't want and then I'm going to show you everything in my closet, like every single piece of clothing. Probably not like my socks and underwear and stuff, but other than that, everything. Ooh, are you so cute. Are you gonna help me to clutter? <laughs> okay, so this is the inside of my closet currently. This is Zach's side, we're not gonna go <laughs> into that, but this is my portion right here and kind of like right here and it's gotten a little a little cluttery so the first thing I'm gonna do is go through all of my clothing and just see like what is it that I haven't worn what do I not like want to own anymore and just be like really realistic with myself about the clothing pieces that I want to keep in my wardrobe. Something else to note is that I try to be very partic particular. Yeah, I try to be very particular. Sorry guys, I'm getting a getting a tripod right now so I can set the camera on it. But I try to be quite particular about just like being honest with myself and being like, okay, am I really going to wear this or am I just like wanting to keep it for some other reason like guilt or because like I spent a lot of money on it or something like that. Okay, you guys, I just took everything out of my closet and this is the aftermath. So something that's kind of crazy about like when you think you have a minimal wardrobe is if you put it all out like on your bed or like a couch or like something on, even on the floor, you start to realize how much you actually have and it's just a really great way to put it into perspective and to help you deal with the mess. So right now what I'm going to do is take some time, piece through everything and decide things that I want to sell, things that are at the end of their life and I need to donate, and things that I want to keep. Putting on a spring playlist to keep me sane. <laughs> It's been about two hours because I took a lunch break, but I finished going through everything. Okay, so in this bag is the stuff that I am going to recycle or just like donate just because it's a bit just at the end of its life. And then in this bag and all the way up this pile is the stuff that I am going to be selling. I like to take my clothes just to Buffalo Exchange or like any one of those kind of like random consignment type stores and just sell them. I think this is easier than doing online selling just because I don't really have to put that much effort into it. Okay, I don't know if this looks too different than it did before, but I've cleared it out enough to where I can keep my like spring summer clothes 
clothes and my like fall winter clothes all out at once instead of having to put them in these baskets which I usually did so that just kind of gives an idea of how much I cleared out. And then in these two bins, this is where I keep all, don't judge me you guys, this is where I keep all of my like Disney apparel because Zach and I go to Disney a lot and I have very specific wardrobe for Disney. So that's my Disney apparel basket, which is all like thrifted stuff. And then in this basket is my like painting working clothes. So it's just like two t-shirts and then my jumpsuit. And then I've got my belt, my beanie and my mittens. And I actually have space for my yoga block and my yoga mat now, which is exciting. And then right here I've got my shoes. I always keep two pairs of shoes downstairs as well. And then over here, I ended up keeping all of my hats. I just really could not part with all of them. And then my jewelry, which is just like four necklaces and some rings. And then my little bandana and my baseball hat. And that is it. And then in my dresser, I've got like bras and undies and stuff and socks in there and then in this drawer I actually have space now for my shorts and pants so I have three pairs of shorts and then I have well two pairs of pants right here I'm wearing my third pair of pants right now but that's all I've got three and three and then in this drawer I've got one workout outfit two like this is a terry cloth lounge set this is fleece this one's cashmere and then these are my pajamas so I feel good about what I have accomplished, but now the fun part. Okay, so this is a super cool thing I wanted to show you guys. So this is from the brand Four Days, your ticket to freedom. I love that. So this is a bag that I got from Four Days, and basically you can fill it up with the clothing that you're done, the ones that are like a little bit worn out, and they take all the fabric scraps or cotton, anything that'll fit into the bag. It can be in any condition except for like undergarments, and they recycle it. What is recyclable? And it is so cool. Like you literally just send it to them, they recycle it, and then you also get like a discount um, and a credit to shop at on their website, which is super cool if you like want to add something else to your closet after you've taken some stuff out. And yeah, so I'm gonna fill up this bag here with the stuff <laughs> that I want to recycle and I'm gonna send it to them. Quick pause before I move on to trying on everything in my closet. Um, I forgot about this brand called Nikki. They're in uh, like an underwear brand. It's spelled K-N-I-C-K-E-Y. And they will recycle your like underwear, like bras, like socks, stuff like that. So you just go on their website. I'll put a link in the description and you just type in like how many you want to recycle to them. And then they send you a shipping label and you literally just ship them right out for free. And now the moment we have all been waiting for, well maybe it's just me, maybe I'm the only one who's been waiting for it. I am going to show you guys everything that is left in my wardrobe. Right. 